What's up everyone? Welcome back to another one. We are at Straight Lake in our backyard. Kate only lives like, what, 30 uh, minutes about, from here? About 35, 40. Yeah, pretty close little commute. I'm about an hour and 20 minutes. Our good friend, Max Sharp, is the owner of Straight Lake, established in uh, 2013. This is an absolutely beautiful place. From the first time we ever came out here, I met Max about two years ago down here and uh, what he's done with this place. I mean, it's, it's it was already incredible, but the work that these guys have put in to the habitat has been absolutely unreal. And, you know, the hunting and the, the bird numbers that they've been holding uh, has definitely been a reflection of that hard work. No doubt, it's legit. Happy to be back over here. I guess we've known Max for over a year now. Yeah, a couple years and, now. Uh, got to hunt with him last year and to be back this year, back in the groove of things. The weather's perfect. We got sunshine in the morning, north wind for the past couple of days. Everything's teed up to be a good one. Um, we're back in our home state doing what we grew up doing and it's, it's irreplaceable for us. So we're happy to be in the woods and for sure. And it's, you know, it is commuting distance, but Whenever Max says, "Hey, you guys can uh, you can come. We'll feed you dinner." They've got these the whole super night. thick yeah. memory foam mattresses. I'm like, "Say no more. We're there." It's better to sleep so, at home. <laughs> that's right. That's right. And we get to sleep in a little bit later. Yeah. So our last hunt in the woods was pouring down rain. So we're pumped about this. Yeah. When it was pouring down rain and it was warm. It's finally, I mean, it's we're almost to Christmas now, and we finally got a little bit of cold weather. I think it's actually going to get down to about 27 or 28. The real feel is supposed to be 25 in the morning, which will be the coldest day we've had in Arkansas yeah. this year. So uh, we do have a full moon that we've got to compete with. Uh, we were we walked out front a minute ago, and you can just hear them out there. Yeah, 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 Man, this place is absolutely awesome. We are so stoked to be here, get back in the woods, some sunshine, and hopefully they uh, they want to play in the morning. Yeah. So uh, we'll be back in the morning. We're going to wake up about 4.45 and uh, maybe get a quick bite and uh, head out in the woods. We'll see you all then. See you on the flip side. Got old number eight tonight. Yeah. These rooms are really, really classy. Super nice. Got my stuff here. Got my camera bag. Just a one night trip, so I don't need a whole lot. Um, but man, these things look some kind of inviting. I mean, that is serious memory foam topper right there. Freaking sweet rooms. We got the man Max Sharp on the wall. Little fat green head, handing it over. This place is awesome, man. Can't thank these guys enough for uh, extending the invite. We are stoked to be here. It's time for bed. A little spot right there. I'd say in the middle, but I need to get one of those pillows because uh, I like to sleep with a pillow between my legs. If you are one of those people like that, Leave a comment below. One pillow, you guys are, you got something wrong with you. I need at least three pillows, so I'm gonna steal one from that other bed. We'll see you on the morning. Well, good morning. <laughs> what we got for breakfast? You got a pop tart and a uh, little fresh coffee pot right there. Better choose wisely. <laughs> <laughs> good morning, Max. Good morning, buddy. Y'all ready? Sleep good after that Saints win. Oh, oh yeah, it's yeah, awesome, buddy. Who that? <laughs> what we got ready? this morning, man? Man, it's clear. We don't have a lot of wind, but uh, we're going to kind of get between two holes this morning on the road and uh, line them up coming down the road, and uh, hopefully we're going to have a great hunt this morning. We're going to have a great hunt regardless, but uh, hopefully we have a lot of ducks that will fill it up. And, Put on a show for us. I'm ready, man. This is gonna be fun. We got two groups going out. We got one with the Argo, and uh, we're gonna be hopping in the side by side. It's cold this morning. It's like 26. 
degrees, 26, 27 degrees, which it's a nice change of pace from the 70 and south winds that we've been uh, that we've been seeing for most of the fall. So it's gonna be good, man. It's a full moon last night, but that's all right. Ain't too worried about it. Got these looking good. Ready to go. Big tree, big tree, big tree, big tree, big tree, big tree. Okay, that's Beautiful. where we're gonna be. And I'm gonna put us a nail in the tree so we can all- I'll shoot them up here. Yeah. Right. Winds out of the north, they ought to come right through that hole right yep. there. <coughs> that easy. No. Oh. <laughs> Dude, I got the sickest shot of that. <laughs> well, that'll work, Max. That's close enough. That was close enough. See that? Dude, did I see that? Yeah. Dude, man. it landed like two feet in front of me. And I just, I had to wait for it to get up to shoot it and it was too close, dude, I just about shot him in half. You... I'm on him. Sun will do some good, Max. Yeah, I think uh, we get some sun on the dummies. It's gonna be all right. There's a lot of ducks. Yeah. Just, they don't know where they want to do. We had a big raft to the west mm -hmm. of us early, so we'll see what happens. Here. We'll get some sun out from the different show. Dead bird back. <laughs> Pintail in the woods. Heck yeah. <laughs> I was trying to get on him, I didn't realize how close he was. Old sprig. Huh. How many of those of y'all killed in the woods? Huh? How many of those of y'all killed about, in the woods? About three or four a year. <laughs> Literally, three or four a year. That was awesome. The first pinch I've ever seen down in the woods. Really? And he sat down, he got wet. <laughs> uh uh, no. I'm on them. <laughs> you didn't want to shoot that green head cage? No, I said you didn't when he was right here. Man. Scared, dog. Huh? Nice. 
I barely got the camera on in time for that. Huh? I barely got the camera on in time. Coming quick. Yeah, they did. Oh yeah, three shots, three, I mean I didn't shoot three times, I shot once, they shot once a piece and they all three dead. There you go, that means it's... My turn? It's... <laughs> we're stacking them up, slowly but surely. Oh yeah man, we're scratching at them. It's been a beautiful morning. Yeah, it has. Not Can't much... ask for much more really. Nah man, just a little wind. That's all you can be greedy. Man. You can just be greedy, you can be greedy and ask for yeah, wind. you could. You could. But then you look out there and see that view and there ain't a whole lot more than ask for. Tell you this, you're not going to decoy courtship flight. What's that? You're not going to decoy courtship flight. As far as getting them to the decoys, yeah. they are not worried about coming to the water. We're going to pick them up and let them get back in here? Yeah, they're, it's a sunny day and we're going to let them get back in here and let them have it. Uh, we had a really good hunt this morning. Got 12 or 15 ducks. Nothing to complain about, that's for sure. No, we could have, we could have used some wind. Uh, a lot of ducks, so a lot of stale ducks. Yep. Let's go have some breakfast. Yep. Let John's waiting on us. He's getting close. <laughs> All right, that's a wrap. Let's go see what Chef John's got cooked up for us. Yeah. Let's go eat some breakfast. That sounds good. But he's waiting on us. Morning, Chef. Good morning. What's happening? What you got going for us this morning? Hey, I've got a bake in the oven, man. Not too much on top, but uh, we're doing a sausage bake um, for breakfast. Heck yeah. Yeah, pretty excited about it, man. You never let me down yet. Not yet. <laughs> I don't plan on doing it. How was y'all's morning? Man, it was good. Yeah. Uh, Could have used a little bit of wind, but the sun was shining. There's plenty of ducks. Nothing to complain about. Uh huh. Looking good. So, making a little gravy for the uh, bait. I got a few minutes on this bait. It's a uh, sausage potato um, egg bait. Oh, but it's looking nice and good That's in there. That's going to be tasty. Yep. Yeah. Oh, gosh, yeah. Absolutely. You say St. John, how'd y'all do this morning? We did all right. You got them? Few of them. <laughs> they were tough. Yeah, they were for us too. <laughs> it was fun. Yes, sir. Five days to Christmas. Dang on. Uh, four mallard ducks. Breakfast is served. Is this steak? Huh? I'm 
no idea. I better try it. All right, we just uh, got our bellies full with an awesome breakfast, and uh, now the the real work begins. We got to put stories together. We got to edit pictures. We got to get vlogs going. We got to check emails. It's a Monday, the Monday before Christmas, so uh, we got a lot of work to do. But uh, man, straight late. Can't thank these guys enough. Max Sharp has been a great friend. The uh, couple years we've known him, we appreciate their support out here and just letting us uh, come out here and enjoy the the beautiful uh, creation that the Lord's blessed us with and, and uh, putting His hands to be a steward of. So uh, that was a beautiful morning, beautiful sunrise, ton of birds. You know, a lot of people in these videos are like, oh, you just go to these places where it's a layup, a layup. You get a sunny day in the trees, private, you know, place, you're going to kill them. It don't really work like that, guys. I mean, at the end of the day, it's still a wild animal. It's still hunting. We had a great hunt, but as you guys saw, we didn't burn them down. We had some do it close. We shot them. We could have shot 500 at the treetops if we uh, wanted to, but that's not what we're about. Um, not, not in these trees. Uh, you shoot them, get them in tight, and shoot them right, or you just don't shoot them at all. Uh, it's just not doing it justice. Smaller groups, shoot them tight, pull the trigger, birds fall. That's what we like, and uh, that's how we do it. Some may not do it like that, and that's okay, but that's how we like to do it, and that's how they like to do it here at Stray Lake, and we think that's, that's pretty dang cool. So, uh, beautiful place, can't thank them enough. Uh, we got some work to do. We'll see you on the next one. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like the videos, turn the notifications on, all that good stuff, and we will catch you on the next one.